first win of the season and a really convincing one here at Lords. That must feel very good. Yeah, it was a pretty perfect week, uh, to be honest with you. Um, from start to finish, I don't think we could have done much more. Uh, obviously, having lost a toss and, and been inserted, I think, you know, um, the position we found ourselves in at the end of day one, we, you know, we felt like we were in a great position. And then, obviously, with the attack that we've got, uh, it's a pretty tough ask for, for any opposition um, batting lineup, I think. So, yeah, so many great performances, you know, as a collective. That's how we want to play our cricket. And um, I feel like we've been building towards this, to be honest. I think we've been playing, you know, far better over the last uh, four or five games. So, uh, yeah, long may it continue. I said on commentary this morning <laughs> that uh, this morning's session was the best bowling session of the season so far for Somerset. <clears throat> Would you agree with that? Yeah, I mean, yesterday they were, it wasn't bad either. Um, but of course, you know, we're, we're fully expecting, you know, today to be a really tough challenge. Obviously, um, yesterday was pretty physical and, you know, our bowlers put in a huge effort to bowl them out. Um, so then to ask them to go again straight away, um, you know, I thought that was an immense effort from them all. And yeah, this morning we were so dry, so disciplined and, you know, we were patient because sometimes we know how the game happens. There can be partnerships. Um, but the fact they didn't really go anywhere and then we sort of picked up um, three or four before lunch uh, just really sort of uh, kept the momentum in our favour and, and as I say, um, it was a pretty complete performance all round. What pleased you most uh, about the performance? Uh, I can't put sort of my hand on one, my finger on one thing, to be honest. So many aspects, obviously GB, the way he played was, was incredible because um, I know he was desperate for a score and we, we, we know... You play badly yourself either. I mean, uh, yeah, obviously very happy. Um, look, we were sort of a couple down early and me and GB, we've actually quite enjoyed batting together at Lords. Um, you know, we were just intent on trying to um, play what was in front of us and build a partnership, you know, not think too far ahead. And obviously as the ball got softer, it got a little bit easier. But yeah, just delighted for GB, obviously getting 100. Uh, worst places to get 100 as well. So um, that was brilliant. And obviously to have George in, in sort of good form in the middle order for us is... It's huge. Obviously, TKC continued his great form, and you know, um, he's such a weapon for us in the middle order. The way he sort of counter attacks and the way he sort of takes the game to the opposition. But yeah, just as a unit, how we were in the field. Um, as I say, uh, what we asked a lot of the bowling group, and they just kept coming, and what about Matt, it was relentless. What about Matt Henry? What, what impact uh, does he have? I mean, he's the dream. To be honest, he's an incredible guy. You know, he's um, absolutely loving him in the changing room and. Yeah, even last week on a sort of a very good wicket, you know, he's just always asking questions. You always feel like there's a chance just around the corner. Um, just world-class bowler, you know, I can't really say much more than that. And um, he's not too bad with a bat either. He just, um, yeah, we're just so lucky to have him. He just seems to have galvanised the whole bowling attack. Yeah, as I say, I don't think we were too far off, you know, previously. I think we've we've been building really nicely and like, we've been playing a lot better cricket. Um, but of course, when you, you add him into into the equation um, you know it just looks pretty relentless and I just felt like we gave the opposition nothing you know there were so few scoring opportunities and you know we created a lot of chances and beat the bat a lot and um, yeah it's a great feeling and just delighted for everyone really to get that first win. You get a first win and then it's immediately changed gear and, and you've got yeah. the, the blast starting on Wednesday in, in a <coughs> big game against Hampshire in which you'll be looking for revenge. Yeah, obviously a replay of, of last year's semi-final. Two really good sides. Um, obviously, I think there'll be a few changes within our team, but um, yeah, just a different challenge. You know, uh, we feel pretty confident in our white ball cricket, and yeah, we're looking forward to the start of that. Obviously, any time we sort of uh, play T20s at Taunton, it, it's incredible. So, uh, looking forward to starting that comp. Everyone fit <coughs> and, and raring to go. Yeah, everyone fit. Uh, squad in a really good place. I think um, the atmosphere around the group and the environment is is amazing. Um, probably as good as I've sort of um, witnessed in my time, to be honest. So, yeah, just we're enjoying our cricket, uh, we're enjoying each other's company, and I feel like we're playing some good stuff as well.